welcome back to Thomas Toys, your favourite and wizarding world. That's right, today we'll be looking at this set. You've got a few spoilers. I should probably go get the horse, horse so we can see it better. Yes, that is right. This is another set review. I actually got it the week after Christmas. Yeah. Those lovely, lovely figures. So, yes. Start. Now, a quick note if we just hop over here. This clear piece does come in the set. So, I'll probably look at the cake first. So, from about um, January onwards, you will see this clear piece in any minifigure videos. I, this is, I usually use it like one second like this but in the actual thing it is like this so it makes a floating cake look for and I will be using it in this set too so the cake is quite good that purple I did get mixed up there's a brown which I kind of thought it was brown but I couldn't find any brown pieces thanks Lego it's also got a nice cherry and it looks a very posh cake. Now let's move on to the six minifigures. Obviously not all at once. So this is Harry Potter. And I think the best part for all these minifigures has to be the hair face. But we'll come. So he has some plain black legs. A nice flannel shirt with a t-shirt on the inside. He's of course got his wand and his face if we take that off you can kind of see it's got it's also got scared face because i believe everyone does have a second face yeah and then also let's just take a look at the hair piece and like i said the hair piece has to be the best part just look at it it is so good for custom minifigures and i'm just so excited to use it yeah, so that's Harry. Now let's move on to... So this is Dobby. I've got a few ideas of what I could use for that shirt. Like a homeless person. And also double moulded short leg. And he's also got a moulded face. I think... Look at that. Kind of see it. With, and that is rubber. So overall, a pretty good minifigure mode. I won't wear it from, I think I might have lost a piece. Yeah, let me find it so we can look at the next minifigure. <laughs> so next we have Pettinoon Dur Dursley. And if you're wondering what piece I lost, I lost that one clear piece. I am now just have to hold it. Because I have nothing else I can do. I feel stupid. Yeah. Well, hopefully I don't stand on it. Yeah, and a clear piece. Why would you like me to find that Lego? Why can't... So this is it. I love that shirt piece. She also has an amazing hair piece. Would you look at that? And this, she has that face. Oh, so her scared face. You really need to try. Right, let's move on to the next minifigure. So the next minifigure is Vernon Dudley. Name is, and he comes in with that jumper piece, which I already have, just obviously with Hans Peach. He has a brilliant face. And an absolute brilliant hairpiece. Like, I finally got that in grey. I'm sure Nick customs out of all this lot. And yeah, and then he's also got a miserable face and a happy face. And no printing on the back. So next we have Dudley Dursley, DD. Which you might recognise as I use him as... Well, I used him in my last video... Well, the child VV recap as me, and I probably, and I'll probably, will always use him as me 
that makes sense as he just perfect represent So as you can see we've got this piece and a shop room which I think is really cool. cool. And then finally, well the final mini figure is Ron Weasley. I think for this I think they should have also, I think as a better set, even if it had been more expensive, I think they should have included his brothers George and Fred. Uh, again that would have been making the car bigger. So this is his hairpiece again. And you might, and I'll probably use him in also tomorrow's video, him and Dudley. And he's also got a wand, as you could just see, two faces. So yeah, now let's move on to some of the other ones. So, we've first got a nice, nice twit to wool owl. And this just doesn't go anywhere, and this is one of my first owls. Say one of my first, as you get two in the set. <laughs> yeah. And you also get this for this sign with yet another owl. If I just raise up a bit, as you can see, it says for Privet Drive, and it's got a brown owl. Which, as you can see, which, if we look on the back, you just kind of connect like that. <coughs> Excuse me. Bless you. you. So this is the car. So starting at the front. It's got a beautiful bonnet design. Design. Until I either build a police car. Or get a Lego police car set. This is, is going to be a police car. The roof is actually in three pieces. And it's got. Um. Quite a big interior, as you can see, but only room for a minifigure. Yes, a minifigure. Back in, you'll see that in a minute, yeah. But the doors, again, yeah, massive. That's a sticker. Moving round to the back, we've got the bonnet, which would open. We've got a Harry suitcase and also a chain. And let's move on to the house. So, the, oh, sorry, the house. If we just grab the... Torch of the day. Yeah. I'll probably move one sec. So this is the house. I'll just light it up so we'll look at the front first, then the back, then the um oh no sorry front inside roof no sorry front sides in front Sides, roof, inside. Do you get that? <laughs> well, if you don't, tough luck. Uh, so this is the hub. We get so starting off. Tell you that so starting off at this side, we've got the drain pipe, which I'll show. We've got some flowers, a lantern, and then it says number four on that. We've got a brilliant door sticker piece and. We can open <laughs> to the door then to open. Then sorry. What I will recommend the hardest part to build of this whole set is that bush there. Like that bush took me at least a good half an hour to build. So yeah, don't touch it. it then it all comes collapsing down. It's also got a window. Then going further up, quite on. I have to use this because I'm not. As you can kind of see, see, we've got a nice roof, and then we've also got another drain, then two windows. Right, let's look at this side. So, this side, well, both sides have a play feature. That one over there has two, just one's not working. Because I think I kind of broke it. Might get it fixed and I can then show you how it works in the future. So, as you can see, it looks fairly normal. This lantern here, if I show you, you can 
pull it on it and it opens up revealing Helen's bedroom first bedroom now I'll show you this because it is right here so we've got a spade and a shovel and also inside we've got a bunk bed if you just look and then we'll kind of shuffle this around but we've also got a sticker over there like right there I found the clear piece! I found the clear piece! Sorry. Then over here, we've got, this is again, and then this is one play piece, so if you pack that chain to that, this just comes out. It's quite nice. And also if you turn the, the lettuce should come out, and that's my broken feature, because I put too many, so lesson learnt, don't put too many, because they all just get stuck. Yeah. Now the roof of this thing is as you can see. As you can see. Yeah, you can't really see, but that's a roof. Then in here, oh, we have we've got a nice sofa piece here, but for some reason, I'm gonna match up. Yeah, my, I think my torch needs a new battery. Yeah, so, so you've got a purple chair. If we just got a purple chair there, nice flower pot. You, you used to be able to turn the knob and letters would fly down the ch chimney. Oh, I've just broken thing. Hashtag Thomas breaks everything. Hashtag Thomas breaks everything. Oh, I'm just breaking everything. <clears throat> Sorry, this is kind of just how I build. And then when I'm not filming, I end up talking to a camera when I build. Which is also... Oh, we do. Hold on. Oh. Oh, I nearly just broke the bus then. <laughs> so this, th that is actually built into the wall. We've got another sticker here and here the staircase and that's where Harry's bedroom is and then you've also got another Harry bedroom with the bed that reminds me so much of Ron Weasley also got a printed newspaper of saying the boy who lived and on his desk he has a photo of his mum and dad he's also got the stool and little sticker so that's gonna be it guys hope you enjoyed have a merry day and i'll see you in a water balloon